queen the queen welcome to my channel happy new year to everyone we're gonna turn these babies into this babies but before that You're gonna need a glue gun, you're gonna need glue sticks, Mod Podge, brushes to use with your Mod Podge, and of course, we're gonna need fabric. Yes, so I didn't know which one to choose. I had two choices, but I was like, you know, I'm just gonna go with the one in the yellow because it looks pretty. You're gonna need your shoes, so you're gonna make a pattern for your shoe. So you're gonna just use uh your fa your fabric and just make a pattern out of it. But before that, let's appreciate this Robel Musiker. This is on 900 in on Florida Avenue. This is a beautiful painting, and I loved it. I was like, wow. So you're gonna go ahead around your shoe like that. Make sure the whole shoe is covered with fabric. And then, like I said, you're going to trace the other pattern from the other shoe to make the other pattern for the other shoe. You know, cut time so that it's easier for you. So you're going to go around like that. Now you're going to put a uh, mud podge on your shoe. You, ha you have to make sure that the whole shoe is covered with mud podge. Like so. So while I'm doing that, you can just watch the video, but... I want to talk about like, like this last two years. Like last year, I haven't even posted anything in my channel. I was just out of it. Like losing my mom and my grandmother in the same year is just, was just horrible for me. It, it, it killed something from me. Like I, I lost, um, I lost a lot. Like I lost my inspiration. I lost my passion to do anything at all. Like I was just out of it. I was drinking too much. I was not happy. I was depressed. So this year I'm trying my best, you know, to like do something for my channel and do something for my business because my business suffered too. I wasn't willing to do anything. And if I was doing something, like if I saw something for some, I was doing shoes for somebody, I, they would not come out right because I was just not happy inside. So this year I'm trying to do my best and come back, you know, and be alive again because you know life is too short but if you went through the same thing and you want to talk to me about it how you coping with it how did you uh get out like not really get over it but how do you get to live with it how do you put it in your daily life and live with it but not be depressed because that's what i want to know so if you have anything to say to me you can comment down below you can send me an email put my email down below if you want to be private about it if you want to talk about it privately it's all good with me and if you have something for me to make you can just send me a uh, email with a picture of course of what you want me to make and i'll just make it you know i'm looking for something to make i'm looking for content like i said i lost my inspiration so if you're willing to help me then let's do it so you're going to trim around the shoe like so. Uh, make sure that you don't cut your, your shoe too, you know. Take your time. You're not in a hurry. So, But you don't want to have like a, a lot of excessive fabric around the shoe, you know. You're going to go around like so. <laughs> English. <laughs> English is like English. You know, English is like English English So you're gonna keep uh, cutting like so like I said please like the video share comment and I just wish everybody will have like a beautiful new year and a happy new year I wish happy new year to everyone you know 
Life is too short to be miserable, you know. Find your happiness. Just just be happy, you know. And, and all things will come through, you know. Wake up with God. Go to sleep with God. And everything will be fine. So you're going to do like so. Use glue wherever you feel like uh, your mod podge did not reach. You can use glue. So you're going to cut your uh, excessive fabric off the shoe. Make sure that it's in a straight line and make sure that you don't cut a whole lot of fabric that's not supposed to be cut. So you're going to go around like so. Yes, like that. You're going to go around like that and make sure that your shoe, you cut it in a straight line and like align it with the shoe and make sure it looks good. You know, even though it's my girlfriend's shoe, it still has to look good. It still look has to look like she bought the, the shoes with that fabric on it. Like that. You're going to keep going around like that. You know, um, you're the only one who can choose. You, you can choose to be happy or you can choose to be miserable. It's it's up to you. So this year, I just woke up and I decided I want to be happy. You know, anything that makes me upset, miserable, it's going to be for that moment. It's not going to be for the whole year or for the whole month. So when you're done cutting, you're going to put more mud patch on top of your shoe. And just to secure the thread so that your your it doesn't thread off on us. <laughs> you know how you secure the bag? You're going to secure the thread this time. You're going to go around like so and secure that thread. Even if you apply a lot, don't worry about it. Because, you know, this, this is Mod Podge. It's going to dry clear. And it's still going to look nice. Looks good to me, and I love how it's looking. Yes, yeah, so this is uh, how it should look, but let it dry. You can leave it dry, and you know, like... Um, if you feel like there's a lot, or you apply it a lot, just... Use a dry brush and just distribute it evenly, like so. And you're going to let them dry. And then they are dry, and this is how your product should look. See how they look good? Yes! And like I said, Happy New Year to everyone. And I hope you all had a good Christmas, a Happy New Year. And please subscribe, like, and share. The queen.